Hey Ute fans, it's Jordan Wynn here with UteFans.net and we are doing a new segment called The Plan to Win where each week I'm going to go over a couple clips that were uh, highly influential in the Utes victory from the previous game. So we're starting off here with the Utes at Stanford Friday night. Uh, the first clip we decided to go with was a third and eight on the first drive of the game. Um, the play resulted in an 18-yard completion to Solomon Ennis on a dig route and I'm going to just kind of walk us through it real quick. So as you can see, Stanford decided to play a four down front, which isn't really what they do um, a little bit of a third down variation and uh, you know they're they're in a nickel defense with two high safeties and so the read here is pretty simple I would imagine um, you know going through this play if you had one high safety you'd want to look to the one on one side since you have two high safeties you're gonna look to the three man side where there's three receivers and really it just comes down to this nickel guy what he decides to do um, in this particular clip he decides to run and try and get underneath the corner route and with this corner sitting right here on the flat route it makes this dig route really pretty pretty fairly open. Um, Cam's main job here would be to hold this backer in the box with his eyes and he's able to find this window here for a big completion. Um, as, as I said, you know, if it was one high you can maybe look to this one-on-one -on -one matchup or even this back out of the backfield one-on-one -on -one with this backer. Um, but in this case with two high both these safeties are kind of playing the deep half and so you want to look to this three-man side. The O-line did a phenomenal job. This is a pretty much a true empty protection look with the running back not having any protection responsibilities and free releasing. So the line has these four down to this linebacker here, meaning Cam would need to do something, whether it's a hot route or change the protection if he felt like this weak side linebacker was blitzing. Um, again, in this particular case, that backer did not. He covered the running back one-on-one. -on -one. Um, if this was maybe a little shorter distance, like a third and three or third and four, Cam could easily drop back, decide he likes this one-on-one -on -one matchup and take it. But with it being third and eight, um, he decided to look to the field and ultimately found this dig route for a big, big first down and a big completion that uh, ultimately led in a touchdown on the first series of the game.